Some speak of the glories of Christmas, some rave about Midsummer's Day, or a Thanksgiving feast or Diwali or Easter is what makes them shout out hooray. But today is the day that for me is the most special of all. It's that magical time of the year as you all will recall. It's the sixth Tuesday before the second Sunday after the first ecclesiastical full moon on or after the vernal equinox, which for these purposes is fixed as being on the 21st of March. International talk like a pirate day, a hedgehog awareness week. Well, Penguin Day, Pi Day, thank someone, it's Friday, these aren't the occasions I seek. Can't contain my excitement, I truly think I must vent or bust. And it's just 83 sleeps till the first Monday following Pentecost. Cause it's the sixth Tuesday before the second Sunday after the first ecclesiastical full moon on or after the vernal equinox, which for these purposes is fixed as being on the 21st of March. I've got my sixth Tuesday before the second Sunday after the first ecclesiastical full moon on or after the vernal equinox, which for these purposes is fixed as being on the 21st of March. Cards written and posted. The traditional six Tuesday April seconds on the after the first ecclesiastical full moon on or after the vernal equinox for these purposes is fixed on the 21st of March. Meals ready to go. Gather round by the fire. Listen out for the choir. Singing all those six Tuesday April seconds on the after the first ecclesiastical full moon on or after the vernal equinox for these purposes is fixed being on the 21st of March. Songs we used to know. Some think that it's got too too commercial. I swear they're not joking. They prefer the anti penultimate Wednesday before an annular solar eclipse is predicted to be visible from Woking. But it's the sixth Tuesday before the second Sunday after the first ecclesiastical full moon on or after the vernal equinox, which for these purposes is fixed as being on the 21st of March.